So uh, when you do a print job, uh, this is the raft that's getting laid down here. Now you've got to be a little bit careful. If you notice that gaps are starting to form or you're hearing a tapping sound, like now, that means the level is not correct and it's actually too close to the board, the foundation board here. And the filament material can't actually get extruded out of the nozzle. Now if that goes on for a little bit too long, what happens is the gears inside the print head um, gouge out a hole in the filament and then the filament fails to feed because the filament's only plastic and the gears are metal so in, in a very short time the gears can wear through that filament and then you get a failure uh, uh, for the, the feed the filament to feed through so you just got to keep an eye on that um, it's uh, usually the failure will happen right at the beginning when it's laying down this raft uh, if that raft is laid down successfully, like you can see it's missed a few bits but it hasn't been too bad so it's it's pulled through but sometimes it'll lay down just a little bit and then completely fail. Uh, you can actually pause uh, as per the instructions up here you can actually um, pause it and you can withdraw the element and then refeed it and then it'll be okay. Um, alternatively, I'll just close that down now um, alternatively, when you go to send the print job, um, you press print, which it won't come up now because it is printing, but then you'll see in the, the window that pops up on the right hand side will be nozzle height. Um, usually you can take about 0.02 millimeter off that nozzle height and that will just lift the nozzle head a little bit off the, the um, platform. Um, and you might have to do that once or twice and then it, then it should work just fine. Uh, that's what I've done in this case. It was failing too much, so I just took the nozzle height down by about 0.02 millimeters, and it's sort of okay. Could probably do a little bit more, but it'll, it'll do now. It'll do okay for now.